A very good morning to you all students. All of you please get ready with your maths book and your maths copy. We already have started chapter 4 multiplication of numbers. I hope you have done exercise 4.1. Today let us do some sums together. Okay. <clears throat> this sums, these examples you will do it in your rough copy. So, first, in this first sum, we can see that here is multiplication of a two-digit number by one-digit number. What we will do? We will always start the sum from the right-hand side, that is from the ones place. First, we will multiply four into two. Next, we will do four into three. So, four to the 8 4 to the 8 we will write here in the ones place next is 4 3 the 12 so what we will do 2 we will write in the tens place and 1 in 1 will go to the hundreds place so the answer is 128 that means 32 into 4 is equals to 128 next we will multiply a three digit number by a one digit number here also we will start from the ones place then tens then hundreds first we will multiply 2 into 3 2 3 is a 6 next 2 1 is a 2 2 to the 4 that means 213 into 2 is 426 that means 213 2 times is equals to 426 now we will do regrouping ones tens and hundreds we have done regrouping in our previous chapters that is in the subtraction and the addition chapters here also we will do regrouping so what we will do first we will multiply 4 8 4 8 is 32 we will write 2 here in the ones place and the 3 we will carry forward to the tens place this is called regrouping of ones that is the number from this ones place we will carry forward to the tens place 4 5 is a 20 20 plus 3 will be 23 3 we will write here 2 again we will carry forward to the hundreds place next we will multiply 4 4 is a 16 plus 2 17 18 18 8 we will write in the hundreds place and 1 we will write in the thousands place so 458 multiplied by 4 is equals to 1832 here we have done regrouping of ones tens and hundreds okay that is 3 from this ones place we have carried forward to the tens place then 2 from this tens place we have carried forward to the hundreds place and this 1 from this hundreds place we have carried forward we have written it in the thousands place so here what we have done we have done regrouping of ones tens and hundreds now we will do multiplication of a four digit number by a one digit number the same procedure we will start from the right hand side four two za eight four zero za zero four two za eight four one za four so please don't write the numbers here and there when you multiply four with two that means this is in ones place so the answer the product of these two numbers you will have to write it in the 
one's place only and if carrying forward of any number is required then only you will carry forward to the next place next four zeros are that means you are multiplying the number of the tens place with four so four zeros are zero zero also you will have to write exactly in the tens place only so don't misplace the numbers okay please keep this in mind next let us do exercise 4.2 this you will do it in your classwork copy maths classwork copy okay let's get started exercise 4.2 you will write like this one number one one thousand two hundred and thirty four multiplied by two equals to here we have to fill in the missing digits okay write the missing digits so in order to find the missing digits we will have to multiply so you will have to show the multiplication like this please don't write the answer directly you will show the multiplication like this two four za eight two three za six two two za four two one za two so what is the answer two four six eight that is two thousand four hundred and sixty eight 2 is already written, next is 4, 6 is written, next 8. So, 1, 2, 3, 4 into 2 equals to 2, 4, 6, 8, 6, 8. Next, number 2, 1111 into 7 equals to 777 dash. So, 1011 into 7 7 ones are 7 7 ones are 7 7 ones are 7 7 ones are 7 so triple 7 is already written last we will write 7 that means 7777 next number 3 2032 into 3 is equals to 6 dash 9 dash 2032 into 3 3 2 is a 6 3 3 is a 9 3 0 is a 0 3 2 is a 6 6 is written next 0 9 also written next will be 6 that means 2032 multiplied by 3 that means 2032 3 times is equals to 6096 always remember when you multiply a number with 0 the answer will always be 0 0 multiplied by any number is equals to 0 so i have done number 1 2 3 for you rest Till number 8 you will do it by your own I'll give you the answers thank you